Hi there, boys and girls. Hello and welcome to Detention. This is the game show that gets your brains ticking and your feet moving. The aim of today's show, of course, is to come out of the end of the lessons with more points than the other team and win today's fantastic prizes. So without further ado, shall we meet our first school that's going to be competing here with us today? Yeah! William. I'm Jess. I'm Archie. And I'm Sophie. And, and we're, we're from Halterworth! Happy Day of the Week! Woo! I'm Archie McIntosh. I'm 11. My favourite subject is literacy and I'm most looking forward to the geography round because I know my countries quite well. Hello, my name's William. I'm 11 years old and my favourite subject is maths and I'm really looking forward to the maths round because I really know my times tables. Hi, I'm Jess Upfold, I'm 11. Hi, I'm Sophie Hall and I'm 10. And my our favourite subject, subject is, is art. Yes, it's Holterworth, kids, yeah! So how are we feeling? Are we excited? Yeah. Gonna give these guys a run for their money? Yep. Yeah. yeah, well good luck to you both. Right. Without further ado, shall we meet the next school that's joining us here in the studios today? Yes! Hello, my name's Hannah Pike and I'm nine years old. My birthday's in April and my favourite subject has to be either literacy, art or drama. The round I'm most looking forward to is going to be the one at the very end where we have an obstacle course because I know that St Mark's is definitely going to win. Hello, my name is Michael Taylor and I'm nine years old. My favourite subject is maths, drama and art. And I think we're going to win because St Mark's are the best. My name is Timothy Ward and I'm ten years old. My birthday is on April 24. My favourite subjects are probably maths and science and the round I'm looking forward to most is maths. Hello, my name is Billy and, and I am nine and my birthday is the 24th of February. My three favourite subjects are maths, art and drama. The round I'm looking forward to will be art, history and the P1 and we're going to win because St. Mark's! Well done, welcome, welcome. That was pretty amazing, those That's dancing moves there. Mighty Mike. Well, uh, I like some of those shapes. <laughs> You're going to be busting some shapes for us later? Maybe. Well, look, good luck. All right. Now, shall we play detention, kids? Yeah! Yeah? Let's get started! Right, shall we get the first lesson underway? Let's see what we'll be starting with. Hold up, hold up, uh, hold up a minute. Boo! Oh, boo you! I'm very sorry, kids. Around, eh? I see Was you've met you? our janitor, Josh. Oh, come on, boo me better than that. Every time you see him on your screens, I want to hear a great big Was it you? boo. That's exactly right. This one's got a cheeky grin on him, this one. Is it you? <laughs> now, Janitor Josh, is it you? You've got crumbs all over you. Have you been eating biscuits? Yeah. Yeah. I don't like the look of these ones. Now, Janitor Josh is going to find any excuse to put you guys into detention, all right? So stay well clear of him if you can. So, uh, before we so rudely cut me off, shall we have a look? What is going to be our first lesson? Let's check it out. It's history. How are we feeling about that, kids? Are we confident? Yep. Yeah. Good. Over this side. How about you, St. Mark's? How are you feeling with history? Good. Well, uh, now, uh, this is going to be a quick fire round with a bit of a twist to keep you on your toes. You'll each have 90 seconds on the clock to answer as many questions as you can. Uh, but what you've got to do is you've got to hop hopscotch over to the desks in the front and lift the lid on the answer that you think is correct. Now, I'll only ask the next question once you've returned back behind your tables and you cannot leave your tables until I've finished uh, the question. Does everybody understand? Okay, fantastic. Without further ado, can we get 90 seconds up on the cloth? Clock? 
Hold to work. You're up first. Uh, it's time to knuckle down and get your brains into gear. 90 seconds, and your time starts now. Who was the first prime minister in the out? Who was the prime minister in the outbreak of World War II? A. Neville Chamberlain. B. Winston Churchill. Or C. John Major. Hey, go, 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 go. Hey, well done. And that is correct. Two. What was the code name for the evacuation scheme? A. Operation Barbarossa. B. Operation Overlord. Or C. Operation Pied Piper. And was that correct? Well done. Uh, three, what do the initials ARP stand for? Air Raid Precautions, Air Raid Practice, or C, Air Raid Participation? 50 seconds left on that clock. Come on, well done. Let's keep these questions coming. Four, what does the word blitz mean? A, a bomb war, B, lightning war, or C, missile war? There you go. There you go. You guys know the answer. A little bit over half a minute left. Well done. Question number five. What sort of shelter was kept inside the house? A, a Morrison shelter, B, Harrison shelter, or C, Mason shelter? There you go. Well done, and back again. Well done. Six, on what date did World War II start? A, the 3rd of September, 1945, B, the 3rd of September, 1940, or C, the 3rd of September, 1939? Come on, one more quickly. What was the wartime name for recycling? A salvage, B rummage, C restore. Oh, that buzzer means you just missed out. I think you just missed out on that last question there, that last answer. Well done. Big round of applause for Holterworth. All right, Holterworth, you managed to get a whole six points for that one. A nice start for your team. Now, shall we see if St. Mark's can do any better? Now, it's the same as before. There's 90 seconds up on that clock. Let's go. Who lived in Britain when the Romans invaded? A, the Saxons, B, the Brits, or C, the Celts? That's it. Well done. <coughs> Two, what is a mummy? A, an animal, B, an Egyptian god, or C, a preserved dead body? Come on, you know the result. That's it, well done. Back behind the desk. Three, who led the revolt against the Romans? A, Betty, B, Vidalt, or C, Boudicca? <laughs> Thank you, Patricia. I haven't been in school in a long time. <laughs> Four, how were mummy's brains removed? A, through their ears, B, through their nostrils, or C, through their mouth? <laughs> well done. Five. What were the removed organs stored in? A, a treasure chest, B, canopic jars, or C, a vase? Yes, that is correct. Now six, what did the Celts live in? A, cities, B, villages, or C, settlements? You went for villages, let's have a look, what was it? Ah, C, settlements, quick, seven. The Egyptians believed that mummifying a person's body would assure what? A, lots of crops, B, riches, or C, passage to the afterlife. Four, three, two, one. Yes, just got that last one in which we shall accept. There's the buzzer, which means your time is up. And St. Mark's, you managed to score six in that round. Well done, big round of applause for St. Mark's. So at the end of round one, our overall scores are six all. Yes! That's what we're talking about. Now, Wait a minute, uh, nobody. Does that mean that nobody gets to go to detention? No! Oh, that's no. not fair! Big boo for oh. Jennifer and Josh. I'm going to get you next round, one of you, you'll see. At the end of re each round, the, uh, the school that loses that round uh, gets one of their team members sent to detention. Fortunately for you both, you both tied that round, so no one is going, which means you have full teams for the next one. So let's have a look. What is the next round? And it is art. So art is the next round. All right. Here comes Janet and Josh, kids. What do we Come do when on, we see quickly, Janet and Josh? Boo to you two. This way, this way. Very big boo. I've heard it all before, kids. <laughs> right, get off. Get, oh, I've got to give them their pens first. Goodness me, where are your manners, sir? <sighs> Almost right. as bad as these. 
Cool. Back to the art round. Now, the rules in this round are very simple, kids, OK? You must choose one of your team members, a budding Picasso, to come up and we'll draw an image that I show you. What it, whatever that image is going to be from this card, you've got to draw it, and your school, your fellow team members have to guess uh, what that image is. Both teams are going to have 60 seconds to see how many they can guess right. Now, you'll also have the right to pass on an image if your team is taking too long. Does everybody understand? Okay, as Holterworth went first last time, St. Mark's, you're going to get to go first this time. So, who is your budding artist? Billy May. Come on down, Billy May. Big round of applause. Come on, St. Mark's. Big round of applause for Billy. <laughs> All right, darling, pick up your pen. Whatever colour you want. You've got black, green, blue or red. Just gone for blue. Girl after my own heart. Right, this is the first round. So, lots of big cheers. And, of course, you can, St. Mark's, your suggestions if you want. To help your team out, your school out. 60 seconds up on that clock. Are we ready to go? Let's do it. That's your first one. All right, guys, what's this going to be? Slide. Yes, well done. First one down. Here you go. It's this one. Mm. Move, move, crack and move. move. Any more? Do you want to pass? Pass, pass on that one? Okay. Yeah. 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 One. Keep yeah. going. Ten. 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 Yes, correct. Well done. All right, one of those. <laughs> That's it. Very helpful, St. Mark's. All right, a little bit over 10 seconds. Come on, you can get this. Skate. Yes, Skate. I'll accept it. Quick last one. Four, three. What is that? Oh, just missed out. That's the buzzer, which means that's the end of the round. Well done there, St. Mark's. Uh, you managed to score three in that round. Big round of applause for St. Mark's. <laughs> now, just quickly, this was a ruler and this was a phone. They were the two that was missed out on that round, but well done, Billy. That was fantastic stuff. Next up, guys, who have we got? Holterworth. Come on, round of applause for your team. <laughs> now, the lovely Sophie is our budding Picasso of this round. So, same rules apply as last time. 60 seconds on that clock. Let me get you a clean sheet. There we go. All right, you ready? Gone for black. And uh, here we go. Here's your round. First question, uh, first drawing, and we're off and racing. Go. Remember, you can help, kids. Hand, fork. Yes, fork. well done. Mind your hand. A flower. 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 Well done. Next one. Well done, better than me. Yes. All right, now stand to the side, darling, if you can draw from the bicycle, side. Bicycle, bicycle, bicycle. No. Pass, go, pass. Yes, I will accept that. Well done. These are very good drawings. It's just so impressive. Rocket, 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 rocket. Well done. Come to the side. It's Sophie, You've got one more. Well done, can we get another one? Three, on. two. Ah, oh, there's that buzzer. Yours. Big round of applause for Sophie, guys. Very well done. That was very impressive. Good girl. That was very well done. Okay, at the end of that round, uh, the lovely Holtworth came away with six, on, and St. Mark's came away with three, which means our scores total at the end of round two are Holtworth on 12 and St. Mark's on nine. Big round of applause. Absolutely fantastic stuff. Well, we're having a great time in here, aren't we, guys? Okay, two lessons down and uh, a few more to go. Who would like to take... Uh, who's, as uh, I thought we'd got away with it, kids. You know what this means. One of them won, so I get to take someone to detention. He certainly does. Unfortunately, as St. Mark's lost that round, uh, Holterworth are going to be able to choose one 
of St. Mark's team to centre detention for this round. So, let's choose. have a look at what oh, this next one? round gonna, is going to be. It might help uh, change your minds as to who you're sending away. What is it going to be? It's geography. Oh. All right, so have a little discussion amongst yourselves and then tell Janet to Josh yeah. who you would like to take away from uh, yeah. my guys over here. supposed to enjoy it. <laughs> it's going to be Timothy. Oh, Timothy, <laughs> big man. Come on, Timothy. Oh, right, You've got to do it. Yeah. Well. I'm going to make him do some times tables. <laughs> Timothy. Big boo. Now, of course, over in detention, we uh, have our kids forced to do their timetables, which might actually help Timothy and St. Mark's in uh, the maths round, which is coming up. But geography is what it is. So, guys, we've chosen Timothy. Uh, have we got any Christopher Columbuses amongst you? We're going to find out in just a moment's time. Yes. And geography is the round. Geography is the aim of the game. We're one team member down on St. Mark's, so you're going to have to work extra hard on this round. What we've got, we have Michael, come up here. And Archie, come up here. Big round of applause. <laughs> These guys are going to be uh, leading the round, this one. So this is, of course, geography. As you can see, we have two maps on either side of the world. We also have some flags from around the world. Now, uh, these two players here, our two team members, are going to be placing those flags up onto the maps which the country, uh, for, to the countries that correspond with, obviously, the country on the flag. The, the little twist we've got for you is our team members have to hopscotch down one at a time, take one of these flags, pass it to the members, and they've got to do it with no help from the team members. Of course, you guys out there can shout and scream and yell whatever you want. You want to help? You can do it. Uh, there's 90 seconds to do this, guys. So... Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what we like. Uh, so get into your positions. 90 seconds on that clock. Are we ready, kids? Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Yes! Yeah. And let's do it. Off you go, you globe trotters. 90 seconds. That's it, come on. Where are we going with this one? Australia. Oh, he's on it. What are you doing there? Well done, well done. Okay. Come on, quickly, 90 seconds, kids. All right. Good work, good work. Some of these are quite tough. All right, the pressure is building. Stab it in. on that one unfortunately <laughs> right now I've got the uh, one opportunity of seeing which ones of these are correct all right let's have a look we've got Canada that is correct Mexico I don't think that's right <laughs> I'm pretty certain that isn't yeah okay Brazil ah that's a big one there matey close but let's go Chile Chile is good what we go over here South Africa, not quite south enough. Spain is good. Germany's good. France is good. Japan, no, it's the Philippines, unfortunately. The, oh, that's Korea. Is that the right? Yes! Well done. And Japan. Whoa. Love that. <laughs> so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven <laughs> over here. Woo! The whole to earth. There's those going out. <laughs> All right, let's have a look here. What we got? United States of America, that one is Canada. Close, but no cigar, matey. Um, Denmark, unfortunately not there. You've got uh, Iceland. Is that Greenland or Iceland? Greenland. It is yeah. Greenland, I thought so. Thank you very much, Janitor Josh. Boo! All right, Italy, that is correct. Sweden, that one is. The United Kingdom, yes. 
Australia, what's that? India, no, close, it's that one there, nearly matey. Uh, Slovakia, not quite, that's the brown one just there. Uh, and this one's China, it's that one there matey. Uh, Portugal and Argentina close, but no cigars. So we've got one, two, three, four over here for St. Mugs. Big round of applause, guys. Well done, well done, mate. Don't worry, I'm terrible when it comes to geography. You did really well, guys, really well. Right, uh, the scores at the end of that round are 13 to St. Mark's and 19 to Holt Big round of applause. And there we go, it is time. It is time to see what lesson we've got up next. What is it? Maths. Woo! Pressure is on. Oh, who is that coming in here with a surprise? Kids, who have we got here? Me and my friend Philippe have got some hats and guns for we've you. Got, we've got a few little things for you for this round. Oh. There you go, love. <laughs> That's okay. Do you know what's in these? Go. There's a hat for you as well, <laughs> Salim. Oh, Look at that, that's what I'm talking about. It's like the there world you go. wild you got your hat on. You got, you got some, I'm getting two. I don't <laughs> squirt, me. He's got two. Hey, you, there you, you go, go Salim. Well, look at that. You're yeah, looking some very, very well. stylish. Did you see what Timothy wrote? Instead of doing his sums, <gasps> janitor sucks. Boo, boo, janitor sucks. Well, Not that, that deserves an extra point. That deserves an extra point. I want another point for St. Mark's. Yeah, yeah. I suppose I should give you one. Yeah. There you go. That's what I call an A, an a plus in creative writing. There you go, it's almost done. Not fair at all. <laughs> all right, it is the maths rounds. Now, luckily, you guys get your maths lesson today, and it requires for you all to play. Uh, so that means none of you uh, go to detention, which is a wonderful thing, isn't it? Uh, so for today's math lesson, we will be playing I Shot the Sheriff. For, so for those of you unfamiliar with the game, each of the contestants has been given a water pist pistol, and they must stand against their opponents back to back. I'll call out a times table, uh, summon the first sheriff to turn around and shoot their opponent with their water pistol, uh, while calling out the correct answer wins the point. Now, do you all understand this? Yep. All right, are you all ready? Yep. Yes. Back to backs. All right. Now, we've got 60 seconds to complete this. And your time starts now. You two. Seven times nine. 63. Yes, I want to say marks. You too. Uh, eight times six. 48. Well done. Five times four. 20. Well done. Uh, let's go into, uh, uh, the next one is three times seven. 21. 21. Lovely, <laughs> yes, correct. Uh, all right, back to the start. Uh, seven times eight. 56. <laughs> 30 seconds left, it's the next one's round. Four times 12. Um, 48. Oh, that was a draw, that one was. Next one. Three times six. Um, 18. 18. 18. Yes, you can help, guys. Remember that last two over there. Four times nine. 36. Oh, yes, over here to Holtworth. 10 seconds left. Three times three. Nine. nine. St. Mark's. Two times seven. 14. Over there, Holtworth. Two times eight. 16. Oh, that was a draw, that one was. Oh, that was close, kids. Big round of applause. Ah! Ah! And enough. Enough with the water pistols. The points scores at the end of the round. Five went to St. Mark's, eight went to Holterworth, which means total points. 20 to St. Mark's and Holterworth are on 19. Janet and Josh, get these pistols off these kids. I'm trying, I'm trying. Sorry. This isn't fair. 28 and 20. Oh, back. Come oh. on, I owe you, sir. Come on, no, you've got to get it back now. What producer Come thought that on, was a good over. idea? And uh, we are back now with our final round. Shall we have a look? What is this round going to be? P. Everyone's favourite here in England. Yes. Now to show you exactly what the PE round entails, Janitor Josh, boo, has prepared a little demonstration for us. If you'd all like to look up at the projector and we shall have a look.
There you have it, simple enough. Now this final round is worth 10 points. So currently as it stands, St. Mark's is on 19. Holdsworth is over there on 29, uh, on 27, sorry. So whoever wins this round is gonna win the game. All right. Now, of course, uh, Holdsworth, as you are in front, you get a four second head start for this game, okay? So you are gonna go on this hand. St. Mark's, you are gonna go four seconds later on this hand, okay? <laughs> You got it? So, in five, four, three, two, one. Hold to earth, go! Three, two, one. Say, Max, go! Yes! Come on, guys! Big cheers! Come on! Oh, you got the Come on! Come on! That's it. Come Go forward. It's on. And off you go, Marty Marty. Go! Let's enjoy that! Don't drop your reckon spoon, Michael! Good boy! Go, 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 go. Go. Run, 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 run! Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yes! Timothy! Oh my God. <laughs> Big round of applause for tremendous Timothy players! Come on, Timothy! Well done, give me five, matey. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that one. Give me five. That's what I'm talking about, Big Man. Well, that was uh, that was the end of that round. And uh, the end of the show. Big congratulations, Holdsworth. Can I get a round of applause? <laughs> They've just won today's game of detention, but of course, uh, commiserations to St. Mark's that you guys have played amazingly well. A big round of applause to St. Mark's. That's everyone, that's you guys too. That's what we're talking about. Uh, you've all done wonderfully today and you won't be going home empty handed. You'll all be leaving detention today with your very own detention medals. So let's give St. Mark's one last big round of applause. Yeah! Yes. Come on, kids. Go. Up here and get your medals. Come on. There you go. Oh. Come on, Janet and there. Josh. Oh, over right. there, St. Mark's. This way there. Yeah, well there done, guys. Go. Well done. Well done. There you go. I still want to go. <laughs> a medal for you. you. And a medal <laughs> for me. Oh, cool. <laughs> there you go. Well done. I'd like there we have it, uh, St. Mark's. But I tell you what, they were outclassed today. You know, they might have won him. There you are. Uh, they were outclassed today by the wonderful uh, Holderworth. An incredible win at the end. Uh, now you'll be leaving today. Come on, come over here, St. Mark's. In you go, come on back over here with me, guys. There you go. Now they'll be leaving today with a detention trophy and a medal for each of them, and of course, some delicious treats. So there we have it. Well done to Holterworth. Now that's it from us here today. Thank you so much, uh, everyone who joined us. Thank you to both of our schools and a huge cheer to our studio audience. You've been absolutely wonderful. Now remember, stay out of detention. <laughs>